Did you know the first selfie was actually taken in 1839? That the use of the word selfie can be traced to 2002. And that according to the Daily Telegraph, more people have been killed in 2015 by taking selfies than by shark attacks. This is My Conscious History. My name is Katja Martin and today I'm asking why? Why have selfies become so important? I mean, I take a lot of selfies, but that's just because I don't have any friends. I have friends. I just I spend a lot of time with my dog Neptune, and he doesn't have opposable thumbs, uh, so he can't hold a selfie stick. So I, you know, I end up, I'm in charge of a lot of things. Uh, so people get all sorts of crazy about selfies. Like you're doing something against the world, and they just hate on them all day long. But I get it, selfies can be pretty lame. Essentially, you're taking a picture and saying, Look how good looking I am today of all days. This is crazy. I looked so good, I had to take a selfie to share it with the world. Yeah, and I feel that way a lot. Or maybe someone's supposed to take a picture of you and they're like, hey, pose for this picture. And you're like, okay. And they take the picture and it doesn't look good. And they're like, hey, is this okay? And you're like, no, Aaron, it's not okay. Can you just get it from a better angle? And then he tries to get it from a better angle and it's just not that good. So you're like, okay, I get it. I'm just gonna take a selfie. The issue with selfies is that they're bland. 90% of the time they show zero insight into your life. And that's all we really want in the world. Human connection. I want to know what's going on with you. Not, not your selfie, not the best angle of light that you were able to make yourself look hot in. I mean, yes, that is impressive and I want to know your secret and your angle, but also like, what did you really do today? That's what I'm more curious about. What makes them okay? So a selfie walks into a bar and the bartender goes, what would you like to drink? And then the selfie goes, and then the bartender, okay, that's a terrible joke. I don't have any more of it, but it is a perfect example of how lame it is to go through your friend's social media and it's all selfies. You're not learning anything about them. The joke goes nowhere and the social media of selfies goes nowhere. So I sat down with my friend, an unofficial official selfie expert, to figure out what makes selfies work for them and what makes selfies okay. So I'm here with Jules, there she is. Uh, we are here together, uh, we are in the Jules room. You can hey, kind Jules. of see it like that, if you look at it like that. She is gonna talk with me today about selfies and about things that she's up to and all of that good stuff. Who are you and what drives you? Yeah, so I'm, um, oh God, who are you? I'm, <laughs> you can start with your name or who are Hi, I'm Jules. Um, I do Booze Light Year with Kaja. Mm -hmm. We also do Comedians On here and there, and we got exciting new things coming up as well that are in the works. Um, but I'm an actress, came from, I reigned from Minnesota, uh, came out here for acting. I live in LA now, mm -hmm. and just rocking and rolling on that. I like kitties, <laughs> I like, Glitter. So what drives you then? You you do all these great things. You're also a producer, which you didn't mention. Oh yeah, Come producer, on. writer, comedian, mm -hmm. dancer. <laughs> Being a good person um, and just treating people well, I think is what drives me. Okay, cool. Uh, so I've been on your Instagram, as everybody should. Insta. And uh, you take some selfies, girl. I got so selfies <laughs> on that. Real talk, do you like selfies and why or why not? Do I like selfies? Mm -hmm. I think they're okay, like I'm not opposed to them, um, but I think everything's good like in balance, you mm -hmm. know? Got a couple of selfies, like maybe throw a plant on your <laughs> Instagram. <laughs> I love seeing what people are up to and I love seeing, um, uh, you know, their interactions and who's important to them. So I think that like family selfies are great too. Okay, so something that you hit on, which I talk about is that you want that human connection. You want to see what everybody's doing. You want to connect with people. Like, how do you think you can make selfies work better either for you or for somebody else out there? Oh God. Longer well, you named arms. one of them, longer arms. <laughs> <laughs> you named one of them, which is like, yeah, like with family and with friends. And with, with your cat, with right? Cats <laughs> with cats. And dogs and bunnies. And right. And yeah, it kind of gives an opinion with it. Exactly. Yeah. So that is exactly, gives an opinion with it. I think that's a great, statement and a great way to think about it is when you take a selfie, also give your opinion about what it is that you're doing or what's going on. on the, along that same line of games that people could play or like 
and when I say play, I mean use to help them take better selfies. With the goal of making them more interesting, more fun, and more about your life. I'm always, always noticing other people's beauty, but I don't always like tell them about it. Like, I think that you should surprise them and do like a flash <laughs> selfie <laughs> and be like, you look really pretty today, let's get a selfie. And then you're, you know, celebrating their beauty along with your own. Only taking selfies if it's a reflection. So, nice. so right, so a mirror, mirror selfies are kind of overdone, so I'm not necessarily gonna say mirror selfies, <laughs> but water or metal or cars. Yeah. Yeah, just seeing yourself in a different light. Yeah, seeing yourself yeah. in a different light. Every puppy you pass, <laughs> you must get a selfie. <laughs> Every single one. Even if it's your own. God, you're gonna have so many pictures I know. of Neptune. I already have so many pictures of Neptune. Oh God. It could be like something that you accomplished that day. I think it would just be nice to make selfies about um, your accomplishments and your achievements that day. That's great. Uh, that's a great one. Yeah, do a no makeup Monday and a only filter Friday. If you ladies or gents have any more, please send them. Uh, I would love to try more games and I will invite Jules to try them as well. Uh, in yourself, what do you feel like you've had to fight against? Like maybe, you know, you thought, oh, I'm never gonna make it because I'm too short or because I'm, you know, not funny enough or something like that. But it, has there been something in your life that you've really felt like you had to say, hey Jules, cut it out. You're not this and you can do it. At first, my way of dealing with it was not quite so positive and productive. Mm -hmm. I think I really, I isolated myself and I fell into depression and um, you know whatever other symptoms of depression I had those as well um, and there was a point where I hit rock bottom and if you want to see the full interview check it out on the interview playlist but what now you've made selfies more interesting for you people now respect you for more than just your looks they're loving your social media but Kaja you say what could there possibly be other than to be respected for your looks? Great question. How to make selfies work for you. In order to make selfies work for you, make them not about you. Yeah, I know it sounds counterintuitive, but I'm serious. Obviously you will be in the photo, but now that you know fun things that you can do in them, do those fun things. Like here's an example of a great selfie. See, this is a great selfie because the focus isn't me, it's uh, this picture. Then do fun things with them. Send them on postcards to all your family members. Put them on magnets and give them to your friends and family for Christmas. Yeah, because you're broke and everyone knows it. Or you could just do what I do and print them as posters and then hang them around your room. One day, these could be considered historical documents and then you'd want them as posters in your room. Plus, if you do get them as posters, it's always nice to start the day looking at your best friend. Good looks, charm, check, check. All righty then, I'm out. If you wanna see my Thanksgiving episode, click right here. If you'd like to be taken to Jules's channel, click right here. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.